everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, are going to take a look at a beautiful 1967 Chevrolet Camaro RS. Pretty car, guys. A um, little history behind this car. This gentleman uh, has owned this car since 1987. Uh, Tennessee car. Uh, they said the car was restored just a couple of years ago. Um, bottom of the car is nice. Good looking car, man. Again, it's got the Rally Sport with a hideaway headlight package. Uh, front and rear spoilers, little cowl hood on it. Neat car. It's got uh, the staggered um, 15 inch, I think they're 15 by 8 um, American Racing Chrome, American Racing Torque Thrust two wheels. Cooper rubber all the way around it. Car's finished in Bolero red. I don't think that's the original color. Uh, black vinyl interior. Good looking car. Again, love the hideaway headlights. You can nitpick. There's a couple little things in the paint. I saw some little touch up marks. There's some things you can kind of pick at on it. Um, it's still very, very nice. Looks like the bumpers are new. A lot of the chrome and stainless are new. Ah, guys didn't get her. That's a uh, little check mark letting me know it's ready. <laughs> it's got the dual chrome mirrors on it. Again, finished in that uh, bright Bolero red paint. See a couple little marks there on your rear glass. New tail light bezels. Nice and straight down the sides. Car's kind of got that old school hot rod look. Yeah, those are the chrome torque thrust twos. 15.8 on the rear, 15.7 on the front. Just got a bigger tire on that rear. It does have front disc brakes. Uh, factory 350 car, factory four speed car too. Uh, it's not a matching numbers car. Uh, it's got a later model 350 in it. Uh, you can see it's got a uh, uh, aftermarket set of angle plug heads on it. Holly dual feed four barrel. Uh, it's got a Victor Junior Edelbrock uh, air gap aluminum in in intake, power steering. Uh, does have ceramic headers on it, HEI distributor, power front disc brakes. Again, it is a factory four speed manual transmission car. Aluminum radiator with a shroud. It's got a nice little cam to it. It sounds great. Pretty car. Original A pillar chrome. Looks good though. Definitely new mirrors, new door handles. Door rubbers, door seams are nice and clean. Mark at the top there. Looks like the interior's all new, new carpet, new sill plates. It 
It's got the bucket, bucket seats, her shifter, sports steering wheel. That's a removable center console if you want that out. Headliner looks new. Uh, pretty much just a bone stock dash showing 34,000. That's obviously not original. Again, it's only been done for a couple years, so I don't, can't imagine very many miles on it. Retro sounds radio. It's got some Bosch gauges in it. Uh, it also has the aftermarket uh, speaker kick panels in it. Dual exhaust. This it's a 10 bolt 373 limited slip rear end in it. All spackle coated here in the trunk. Floors and stuff are really nice underneath. Looking car. It's got her shifter, padded dash, that looks new. Sports steering wheel looks new. You know, it's funny, I, I never liked those little uh, center consoles, and now I've got a couple in my cars. Man, I like them. And it's nice. I'm a I like to cruise in the morning with a coffee and it makes it really nice to do that. really for gauges in there it's really a fuel gauge uh, for the factory parking brake does work Down these cars, so 